the snow. It's a lot of fun, and we have, we're having like a good grab bag of sunshine and snow, I feel like. Oh, we had a taste of spring earlier this week. Indeed. Temperatures over, over 40 and sunshine. It was beautiful and had me really looking forward to the rest of the season and yeah. uh, what spring has in store for us. Well, and let's talk a little bit about, you know, spring skiing because spring skiing is a ton of fun, but mo a lot of folks don't know is that March is Colorado's snowiest month, followed in a close second by April. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And we're already well over the 200 inch mark for the season. So, mm -hmm. I mean, as you can imagine, the slopes are covered and the skiing is great, but uh, with our snowiest month, to yet to come, we, right. uh, we've got a lot of great skiing still ahead of us. So. I know. Oh, absolutely. We're, I feel like we're, we're kind of, in a way, it's like we're just getting in the groove of things, really. Exactly. And this weekend, um, you know, spring skiing always makes me, it kind of, I don't know, I feel like it brings out like the fun and the like, you know, laid back fun attitude in a lot of people. And uh, you have some family ski race days. What, explain, explain to me. I think I just butchered that. No, exactly. Talking about fun, um, we're having our free family race days uh, series continue this weekend mm -hmm. on Saturday with a free fun family race day. Uh, basically, grab a friend, grab a family member, grab that stranger on the chairlift next to you, <laughs> and uh, challenge him to a timed race on our dual slalom course. Um, Bragging rights are sure to ensue. and uh, I was going to say, good little grudge matches here and there. Exactly. You know, families absolutely love it. Kids love it. Well, of and course. Of course. And if your family's competitive. I exactly. It's let's, like I said, I am all about the grudge matches with my friends and my family because why not? Exactly. <laughs> and the best thing about it is it's all ages, all abilities. Mm -hmm. um, even the little tykes can do it. And, oh, uh, cute. Yeah. So uh, the little kids have a great time doing it. It's put on by the Loveland Ski Club which Very is cool. uh, our race club mm -hmm. and um, you know if uh, people if kids are interested in it having a good time then it's definitely something they can uh, pursue with the Loveland Race Club ah, later. I, I grew up in a ski club myself and I have to say I thank my parents for it every day because it was some of the best days of my life and I'm still friends with a lot of the kids from it too so it's and, a great life experience. And a great skier because of it probably. Well <laughs> I've been skiing since I was five that's very nice of you to say thank you Duncan exactly. and then also too though I mean there are just so many wonderful things about Loveland um, you know you can really beat the crowds. Yep you know beating the crowds saving money free parking uh, you are speaking my language. I love all of these things. <laughs> you know, skiing, skiing is a great activity, and I don't think it was ever intended to be so expensive that you couldn't go and enjoy yourself without breaking the bank. Absolutely. And, you know, over at Loveland, we, uh, we like to keep it real, and, uh, you know, you can afford a hamburger in the cafeteria, and... Uh, I like that. And you know. they were just showing some views of Loveland. I think that's one of the cool things. It's one of the things that I really appreciate about Loveland is that while you may see Loveland, you know, conveniently located right off, off of I-70 and then and they're showing some shots here, all of a sudden you take a chairlift up and you're like, holy cow, I'm literally on top of the Continental Divide and it's just this massive expanse of of terrain. It's incredible. Exactly. You know, a lot of people don't realize how much terrain we actually have because you can't see it from the highway, mm -hmm. even though you literally drive by right, right by the lift. Right, right, right. And it's it's um it's kind of almost like a European Alp feel when you when you get up high. It's really cool. Yeah, especially above tree line. And uh, another thing that people might not realize is we offer free cat skiing up on the Continental Divide. Yes. It's uh and as you're talking with new snow and mm -hmm. spring still to come, um, our Ridge Cat offers amazing turns, rides to some of Loveland's best terrain, some of the steepest and deepest so if you uh if you like to get after it uh the loveland ridge cat is your ride to the goods perfect well that is such a good thing to know and it's a great time for the entire family and uh, also too we should mention how much fun your shop is as well there's all kinds of fun things there it's one of the things i love about small ski resorts are my you know, favorite. I almost forgot, but we do have an amazing shop with uh, all the gear you need, not just, uh, you know, sunscreen and lip balm, but uh, the technical outerwear from top brands, all sorts of skis, snowboards, and the accessories that make them go, and uh, just an amazing shop right at the base, and prices that aren't like a ski area normally would. It's more like a shop you'd found, find down in Denver, so right. affor again, affordable and uh, great selection. So. Well, always a good time over at Loveland Ski Area. Folks, I highly recommend that you check it out, and maybe we'll see Duncan popping around. I always see you. You're, you're always around, Duncan. You're very ubiquitous over there. You know it. <laughs> so for more information, where should folks go? Everyone can find more info at skiloveland.com, 
about the Ridge Cat, our sport, great sports shop, and um, events coming up. Perfect. Well, thanks so much for joining me. Folks, be sure to check out the free family fun ski races over at Loveland. It'll be a great time, and that's taking place on Saturday. Thanks for joining me this morning, Duncan. Thanks, thanks for having me. Folks, we've got more Summit Sunrise coming your way. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back.